You might not think that rock climbing and yoga have much in common, but indeed they do, at least in the mind of one Flagstaff resident. And AZ Today's April Hedinger joins us now in the newsroom with more. April? A rock climbing yogi is bringing something new to Flagstaff. And Seibert shows how she applies yoga techniques to getting up the mountain. Seibert's passion for rock climbing began in 2007. It was just something that I fell in love with instantly. But after a shoulder injury, she tried yoga to help with her recovery and discovered that it also helped her climb harder for longer. I think yoga goes with any type of sport. So if you're um, a mountain biker, if you're a runner, if you play um, a team sport, I think that yoga is something that can benefit athletes of all various ages and types. Seibert decided to bring her knowledge to the rock climbing gym, Flagstaff Climbing, to teach yoga for climbers. She says climbers have found that it can be helpful with one of the most common problems they face on the mountain. When you're climbing and you're up high and you're getting exposed, you get nervous. And one of the first things that you do is you stop breathing. Breathing is a key foundation for yoga, and Seibert teaches her yoga students how these techniques can be applied to rock climbing. Flagstaff Climbing owner Jason Henry sees Seibert as a two-sport mentor. You know, Anne is a really well-rounded climber. With the yoga, she, she also has a ton of experience, and a lot of her experience lies in climbing related yoga. This weekend warrior compares rock climbing to a game of chess and unlike a climbing wall there's no tape indicating where to go. Outside though for me is probably where the yoga and the climbing connect more because when you're outside you're you're just it's so quiet most of the time when we go climbing there's no one around so it's keys into that meditative state. Seibert's yin yoga class offers a meditative style where students hold the poses for longer periods of time with the goal of reducing climbing injuries. Climbers tend to get a lot of connective tissue issues, um, just, just kind of comes with the territory. And having something like Anne's yoga class to um, kind of release a lot of that connective tissue tension um, not only is it a blast, but you really reduce your risk of injury and you're able to climb harder for longer, mostly thanks to Anne. Flagstaff Climbing hosts cyber yoga classes on Sundays at 9.30 a.m. Live in the newsroom, April Hedinger, NAZ Today.